Okay, I'm was having trouble with thumb drives. I've got the latest version of XFCE installed on Arch Linux, and if I plug in a thumb drive, uh, nothing happens on the screen, which it should bring up a little icon here. You click on the icon, and there's your your device with all your files in it. it should say the name of your of your um, USB device, but this doesn't seem to work right now. So I found an easy solution is just to install um, SPACEFM. So I hit enter, it asked me for the password, and away you go. Um, I've already installed it, so anyway, that's the command to do it. SUDO Pacman PACMAN dash capital S SPACEFM and uh, it installs and, and then after it installs what you end up with uh, is under system you'll see space FM now what I would do is just drag it up here and create a launcher at the top you see what I mean uh, you take the the um, application from here drag it up oops yeah drag it up here and it's going to allow you to create the launcher so you click create launcher and it appears up here so from then on you just click on here on this and it'll open the device now if this doesn't show up over here you click on devices and see where it says show devices you click that you uncheck it and it goes away you check it and it shows the devices so if I click here there's all my files. It mounts it automatically, and there you go. So, uh, and at that point, if you have uh, music files from your from your um, um, hard drive, you bring up that file manager in any way you want to, and just copy them over there, and see if it were uh, not already there, it would just copy them over. But at this point, it's asking me if I want to overwrite or skip or whatever. See, if I if I did uh, uh, several files, I'll just hold down on my mouse and select four of them. Uh, and now, see, if I wanted to edit it further, I could click, hold down the control key and click one, and that deselects one. Now, if I pull these other three over, it's going to say, do you want to? It's just going to start copying them otherwise. But at this point, I've copied them there. So, so I click skip and ask me for the second one. And then the third one, as you can see, it would have copied all three of those files over to the thumb drive had I not already done it. So anyway, that's how it works. And of course, if you just click on a file, you can um, right click and delete it. And you'd get rid of the file if you wanted to edit these files. You, you're basically just creating files or deleting them is all you do so and this would probably work the same if it were an mp3 player as well so um, most mp3 players going to mount just like this so when you're done though you would want to right click on this device over here and unmount either remove eject or unmount both of them are going to do the same thing so I just left click on that and it unmounts it and you can close the application remove your thumb drive and that's that so it's a fairly simple workaround seems to work okay um, anyway I recommend using it seems to work fine and it's easy to use uh, and hope this helps thanks for watching